I'm in Ecuador. I'm outside of a community called Tingo Pucará. This is actually the Pucará. This was a, a, an outpost fortress that was built by the Incas. And this was along their, their trade route. And you can see uh, they had a very good view of the surrounding area to guide uh, travelers and merchants from the coastal region, which it would be in this direction, uh, towards the, the interior of Ecuador, which would be in this direction. And uh, this is the neighboring city of Guangaje. Alright, next I'd like to explore the Pucará. Pucará is terraced, and these are man-made steps that guide you up to the top, the peak of this, uh, this structure. I want to walk up them. So I'm walking up this uh, terraced pathway. This must have been uh, similar to what the Incas would have seen thousands of years ago when they were building their trade routes and communication networks. I'm still walking up the pathways of the Pucará. You can see some some llamas here grazing on the grass. I'm at the summit of the Pucará. You can see what a view the, the Incas must have had when they were looking out over the trade routes. This is a community of Tingo Pucará. They speak a language uh, called Quichua that's similar to what the Incas uh, would have spoken thousands of years ago. And the word Pucará actually means fortress. And they were defending this site because there's a really great source of water in the base of this range. Uh, which we'll look at later. I've walked back down. I'm at the base of the Pucará. Here's another view of the community. Back up to the summit. Down into the valley. And these power lines actually extend to a pump house. And this is the water source the Incas wanted to keep watch over and, uh, and secure for the, the travelers that are coming through this area. And today, we've uh, constructed a pump house that will deliver water from the base of this valley up to a water tank in the community. And so we'll be going down to the water source. There's some caves where the Incas used to stay and collect the water. Exploring the base of this this encampment, this community later. Over here is the cave of the Incas, where many merchants and travelers going through this way would stay. And this barbed wired off is the water source, which comes to the pump house. And the pump house will pump the water to the top of the mountain where the Pucará is uh, for the community. This is another view. So this is the water source. Over here is the cave of the Incas. pump house. So this is the water tank that stores all the water that we pump from the source, the Kiloa source, the base of the, the hill there where you can see those power lines. That's where we were the other day. So this is the water tank. It's full of water right now. This is the float switch. 
that will shut off the electric pump when the water level is sufficient. Walk around the side of the tank. Okay. And right down here are the valves that control the water flow to the community. Down in the hills. Okay. Gracias. Gracias.